Well everyone, let's go ahead and take a look at a few different ways you can get free V-Bucks in Fortnite. Now this works as of 2022, but the main way to go ahead and get V-Bucks in my opinion is to go ahead and complete challenges and quests within Fortnite Battle Royale. So from what I've read on Reddit, all these other places still for so many years now, this is probably the best way to do it. There's also daily login bonuses. There's quests within Fortnite Save the World mode if you want to go and set it up that way. And that's pretty much the main way to do it for the most part. Now you can also get free V-Bucks in Fortnite if you go ahead and complete those in-game quests. That is another big thing to keep in mind. I've seen a lot of posts like this one from, you know, this user Evans Collins 445 on Reddit. They went ahead and did a great breakdown of essentially the main ways to go ahead and go through and get, you know, certain types of V-Bucks that way. But I still think one of the best ways to do it, in my opinion, is still going through Microsoft Rewards. So this method is probably the better way, like I mentioned. Essentially, you sign up for Microsoft Rewards, which will be a link in the description if you want to go do it. It's not an affiliate. And all you have to do there is go ahead and make an account. You use different things you can do. You can use Bing as your search engine. You can go ahead and get points that way. You can still go through and still fill out daily quests and, you know, little reviews and different things like that online as well. And at that point, all you have to do is go ahead and once you have a lot of points saved up, you can redeem that for a Microsoft Rewards gift card. And then you can take that Microsoft Rewards gift card and you can go ahead and make your way to their Microsoft store and you can redeem that for a Fortnite or Epic Games gift card. And at that point, once you go ahead and do that, you're pretty much good to go. All you have to do there is go ahead and redeem that within Fortnite. And that's pretty much all you have to do. From everything that I've seen for the most part, that's probably one of the better ways to do it. And that's probably what I would recommend for you to do as well. So that kind of covers it up. If you have any other thoughts, or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.